Hi, I'm Josh from Tether Tools, and today I'd like to talk to you about using monitors in your next photo shoot. Monitors are a great way to see your images larger. You can check focus, lighting, and composition. They're also a great way to collaborate with others on set. Use it when you're talking to your models, your art directors, your makeup artists, or even parents. There are two ways to integrate monitors in your workflow. The first way, probably the easiest way, is straight into the HDMI port on the side of your camera. Most DSLRs come with either a micro, a mini, or a full-size HDMI port. You simply plug in the HDMI cable and you're good to go. One accessory that makes this a little easier is the Tether Tools HDMI swivel adapter. It allows the cable to move a little bit while you're shooting, which will take some of the pressure off the port on your camera. One limitation of the setup is whatever you would normally see on the back of your LCD screen is what you're going to see on the monitor. So if you have image review turned off, you're going to have to hit the play button and cycle through to have them show up on the monitor. Also, if you're using live view, that's going to show up live on the monitor and you're going to see your camera settings around it. It's a little less control than the second method, which is to integrate your monitor with your tethered setup. In a tethered setup, plug the monitor into the computer or the laptop that you're tethered to and use it either as a primary or secondary monitor. Now when you're shooting images, they're going to show up right on the screen in real time or you can use it as a secondary monitor and just drag over images that you want to show up there. You can also use it if you're shooting wirelessly with the Case Air. If, whether you're using an iOS or an Android tablet, you can go HDMI out to the monitor, although you may need an HDMI adapter, so you'll have to check with your user guide on that. The obvious next question is how do I mount my monitor? You're going to need your monitors to be as dynamic as your photo shoot. What that means is whether you're shooting indoors, outdoors, in the studio, or on lake location, you've got to make it easy for your monitor to be set up and be there ready to use. So in another video, I'll cover all the mounting options to mount it to C-stands, light stands, or tripods, as well as any adapters you might need to make that happen.